Taurus, what's up? Hi, everybody. My voice, um, it's going out a bit, so. <laughs> Yo, man, I be around some people that be funny as, I don't know what. Torres, Torres, how are you doing today? I know many not me to view this, but it's okay, okay? I want to get to people, okay? Look, okay, listen. I want to get to people that need a message, okay? I, yeah, 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 you talk and say what they want. Ah, there's nobody under the, 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 the view this and all that, 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 that. I get it, you too. Thank you for the vibe. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. But I, it's for people that can get to it, okay? Okay. And I, depending on how I'm feeling, I might do another message for the collective so let's get on with it Taurus okay because y'all tired of my fake accent but guess what I never get tired <laughs> spirit please understand Taurus okay if you're new here not one size fits all it'll never fit all on this channel if you want a personal reading hit me up all right oh they almost should have said that what was that message because it flew baby it flew let me see Hi, chronic feelings of emptiness and boredom. Torres, what did you do as a friend, eh? Ooh, what up? Ooh, Torres. Okay, Torres, with just these two cards I love, okay? You put a wall way up on somebody. And I'm telling you, Torres, they is trying to climb this mother effer. Like, it is nobody's business. I think they're trying to climb. Like, it's, it's, um, it's giving... Yeah, that's what it's, it's getting desperate, desperate. Chronic feelings of emptiness and boredom. Since you escaped from something, um, someone hasn't been able to concentrate. I don't know why I'm hearing that. Since you escaped, you escaped. Somebody thinks towards being mad at you, okay? Or like giving you silent treatment. Somebody's about to lose this, this silent treatment. I don't think that it's a game. For somebody, it's not a game. They're not playing. But for somebody else, they're like, oh, yeah, I got Taurus beat. No, they don't. Stop stop worrying. Spirit knows what's happened. Stop worrying. Spirit already knows what happened, okay? So Spirit already knows what happened. The wall being up, Taurus, is your defense. You're defending yourself. And there's nothing wrong with that. Just make sure you don't keep it up for every single person you encounter because that can cause you to miss a lot of opportunities, okay? Um, this chronic feeling of emptiness and boredom, I feel that as some of you, Taurus, but I'm also feeling like this is the other person. When we disconnect from people that we like talk to or we think we have some type of flame with them or flame, whatever, we tend to get a bit comfortable and there's no escaping that. We're human beings. But spirit doesn't want you to worry. They know what happened. Okay? They know what happened. Just stop the worries. All right? Spirit saw everything. Okay? God sees everything. Spirit, give me something on this. What is this? What's this uh, chronic feeling to infancy boredom? I feel like this is someone else's energy, Spirit. I have to be honest with you. I feel you. Look at this. I can't make it up, Taurus. <laughs> Okay, sorry y'all, just, I feel you, someone can feel you, y'all are feeling each other, I have to be honest Taurus, you and this person are feeling, it feels boring right now, you feel empty, you don't feel like there's um much to talk about yet, y'all want to say so much, do you feel what I mean, you feel what I mean Taurus, you know? I feel you, Taurus. You feel what I'm saying? <laughs> okay, babes. Let's get out some... Um, uh, let's see, babe. Index, shall we? <laughs> I haven't bought these out in a long time, have I, Taurus? Those that have been with me for a long time, you know. I get people that when I do private readings, they ask for these specifically. So I kind of got to like play musical chairs with these because it's thick. Not that kind of thick. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
Okay, Spiriats. Take that half. I got you, Spirit. I got you, Spirit. I hear you, Spirit. All right, Taurus. So, so I don't know why. I just felt the need to just like immediately get a, a card for that. That's enough. That's great. Okay. So, what we got here, Taurus, is if it's not love, then what the hell is it? So, someone's questioning themselves. Someone's being told, Taurus, okay, that someone doesn't love you. Someone's telling you that, that someone doesn't love you. And so you're like, well, what is this this pull or what is this energy that I'm feeling? Like, I have to have this wall up and I feel this person constantly. So what the hell is it? It's a soul tie, in case you're wondering. Okay, it's a soul tie. Whether it's you or the other person you're dealing with, it does not matter anymore. It doesn't matter anymore. You and this person can argue all day long towards you guys are blue in the face. Whatever happened in the past, it doesn't matter anymore. It's already done and gone, okay? And it says, stop worry. Stop worry. Spirit knows what happened. God sees everything. Like I said, why won't you just cave in like I, like you normally do? See, I told you at the beginning of this reading, like, look, Taurus, like, come on. Out of all my index cards, okay, y'all saw that thick deck. <laughs> together really why are you doing that spirit i'm sorry anyway y'all saw all them cards taurus and this came out at the beginning of the reading i said that i said somebody's like there's like a game here but i feel taurus you're not playing this i got this in y'all's reading the other day but somebody's feeling a lot of boredom right now like they're feeling so bored in their mind, in their heart, like they have so many people around them. They're in crowded rooms full of people, and they just feel like they're in, they're they're empty. They're bored. They want somebody to play with, somebody to be with, somebody to. For some of you, somebody just like they miss playing games. I miss not playing games, but like literally like playing on your emotions, like literally. But your wall is all the way up towards or this is cross watcher and now they're bored but they still feel you okay they still feel you like they can't it's emptiness and boredom they need something to fill that void okay and spirit again doesn't want you to worry somebody here towards maybe you or the other person is worried about how somebody did you dirty and you're waiting for them to get their karma they're gonna get that sometimes my loves we do not get to see people get their karma Sometimes we have to leave it up to the divine and God himself to be able to take care of everything. We don't have that. Um, we, we sometimes don't get front row seats to karma, okay? Sometimes you do, but not all the time. So if that's what you're waiting on, stop waiting. Because uh, Spirit, what's this wall of energy for Taurus? Look. Gratitude in reverse because someone failed to show you exactly how important you truly were. Somebody failed to appreciate your energy when it was there. So you remove yourself. And this person's playing the blame game. Oh, that wasn't my fault. Taurus didn't do this, didn't do that. I mean, come on, man. Somebody here is childish. As we all know, but Taurus, somebody's about to reach out. Believe it or not. Believe it or not, my friend. Hey, you decide who you manifest and what you manifest. I never, ever, Taurus, in my life. Never, never. Never do I encourage people to manifest another person. I, you know why? Okay. You know why for some of you. But the other one that just said, why, Loren? I tell you. Because when you manifest a person, like, let's say. No, no, no. I ain't saying that because I already know it'll come into fruition. I'm not manifesting anything. Look, I manifest, okay, like, let's say this coffee is a person, okay? I want that person, I want that, I want that person named Mocha so bad. No, what if there's a person named Mocha out there? Let me, let me just, I want this, okay? And I get that, but having free will, I need to understand that that person can still not have any changes and still bring hell back into my life. Like, I manifested that. Like, I wanted them back so bad. 
I manifested that nasty behavior back into my energy, into my space. 10, 10 on the clock when I said that. Don't. I just don't recommend it. Because I feel like there's a lot of you that are very strongly powerful to manifest, to ask for what it is you want from the universe, from God, and you will get it. But that person will come back doing the same thing they were doing before. You'll be like, wow, I manifested them back. I got them back. Why is it like this? Well, God doesn't make us do things we don't want to do. Hey, he leaves it up to us. Spirit does the same thing. So you think that they're going to just make somebody just switch at will because you're ready for them? No. We have to understand that in, when people come around us, Taurus, some people are who they are before we met them. We just decided to make up a picture that, well, they're showing me this right now, so automatically got it in the bag. That's who they are. That's where we mess up because we try not to see it that way. We want, we want, we have this fabrication in our mind that they're this or that, but they're really showing us something else. And since we want to go with what we want to see, we miss the red flags. Be careful with that. But I think whoever this is, Taurus, that you're dealing with, they're very sick to the stomach right now. They know that they didn't take you. They took you for granted. They know. Gratitude in reverse. That wall went up, Taurus. I don't think that this happened overnight. Oh, you didn't appreciate me last week. Okay, wall up. That's on you. That's on you. It, that's, that, that's on, you know, this was time and time again. Spirit, let's go ahead and do some clarifying. Wall up, please, Taurus. Uh, Spirit for Taurus. Hold up, Taurus. Somebody really needs your help. Somebody really needs your help with something and it's like not it's not um it's not it's not fake. They're not playing when, when if they if they come to you with this, they're not lying. This is for somebody. I don't know why I'm being told to say that. Four of uh, pentacles in the reverse. Okay. Wow. Okay, four of pentacles in the reverse. So something that was for somebody. I don't know who that's for. You'll know. It could not be for nobody. Hopefully the person gets the message. Um, four of pentacles in the reverse here with gratitude in the reverse and wall up. Yeah, you had to let go. Sorry, uh, my baby. You had to let go. Mm-hmm. You had to let go. You're holding on so tightly. Remember I just discussed that image in your mind of this person was so grand. It was so big. If only this person could see through your eyes how you saw them, I think they would have been shocked because they probably don't think of themselves that way, the way you saw them, Taurus. Spare a wall up for more, Taurus. Two of Pentacles. And now that wall is up and now they don't know what they have to do. They don't know, I mean, if you look at it, four, uh, four pentacles in the reverse, there's a lot of earth energy here. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. The four pentacles in the reverse and the two pentacles in the upright, that's six pentacles. But the thing about it is, Taurus, you were doing a lot of the giving. You know how you see the six of pentacles right in the upright, that person that's sharing with everybody. You were doing most of that. Well, now you let this person go. You're letting them go. You're not holding on so tightly. If you're still holding on, you could still be, but... At the same sense, Taurus, this energy here now does not know what to do with it. Now your wall's up. It's like two of pentacles. What do I do? do I, am I important? Am I not? What's going on? Like, there's a battle of silence here. You're not communicating with this person right now. You can only go by what you feel, Taurus. And you feel this person too. I think y'all feel each other. But I think one person's feeling like really crappy versus you, Taurus. I have to be honest. Or cross watcher, whoever you are. Okay? Yeah, page of pentacles. All right, chronic emptiness and boredom. I feel you. I feel you and I want to make some type of offer. I want to make a gesture. I want to talk to you. I want to talk to you. And this is like a, this is like a, a, a solid conversation. Sorry, guys, I just stuttered. This is like a solid conversation, Taurus. This is not like um, uh, hitting you up with a text. So how's your day? No, this is like about, you know, what do we do about this? Because I'm feeling so left out. I'm feeling so left behind. 
Like, is there any way we can meet up and actually talk? And I don't mean, Taurus, please do not jump in bed with this person. Okay? They will cipher your, they'll cipher your energy that way. Alright? That, that's not the first thing that should be on your mind with this person. I'm sure you can have your intimate feelings, of course. I can't tell you how to feel, but just don't jump into to, to bed because they don't they won't take it seriously. I don't know who this is. If it's not love, then what is it? If it's not love, then what is it? Spirit for Taurus. All these pinnacles are just out here, Taurus. That's it. This is all your energy. Somebody keeps thinking about you. Yeah, look, King of Swords. If this is not love, then what is it? What the hell is it? Somebody really wants you to be firm and honest. And they want you to come at them direct. I think they need to do that. Some, unfortunately. If it's not love, what the hell is it? They need to come correct what it is. What it is that they're feeling. Because Taurus, I think that you've been kind of blocked off and been like, so if you didn't love me, like, what was that all about? Like, our, our nights together, our spend time together, all those talks we had about doing this and that. Like, what was it? They need to come in correct. They need to come in in an adult manner. They don't need to come in childish. I think the King of Swords suit. Spirit, clear, clear, clarify the King of Swords. The Knight of Swords in reverse. This person wouldn't even know what to say. They're trying to find a way to come in quickly and say it, but they're stuck. Knight of Swords in reverse. So they can't turn into this King of Swords and give you the direct answer until they get up out of this funk. Whatever this is. Whatever this is. I think it's crazy thinking. They're sitting up with chronic feelings of emptiness and boredom. But they, they want to make some type of offer. They really want to make a solid conversation. Because all they feel is you. That's all they feel is you. Spirit, stop worrying. Spirit, what do you want Taurus to not worry about? Oh, wow. Ten of Swords. Spirit saying, stop worrying about this backstabbing this person did to you. Whatever it may have been, Taurus. Okay. Spirit said, don't worry about it. They saw everything. They know what happened. Like I said at the beginning, some of you will not get to see this person's karma. Some of you Tauruses are this person's karma. You're their walking karma. You walked away or they walked away from you. Ha ha, Taurus, the grass is probably greener over there. But guess what? I already know you'll be waiting. No, wall up. You don't appreciate me anyway. Okay, so I'm going to let this go halfway, of course. I don't know why I'm feeling halfway. Like, it's like you're holding on, to, you were holding on like this, and like you're kind of like slowly like just, you know, that's what I feel. But what, the, what, what Spirit's saying is that the, the hard part's over. The Ten of Swords is an ending. And the thing is, Taurus, is that you felt like your hands were tied behind your back. Like there was nothing you could do about this, this betrayal or whatnot. There was nothing you could do about it. It was meant to, it was meant to occur. It was a test. How much do you love yourself to know that these individuals or people or person would do this to you? And you had no control over it because it was meant to occur. It was painful, but pain helps us to grow. Believe it or not, pain is growth. It definitely is. You know that first love Taurus you may have had many years ago when you were in junior high or anything like that. And you thought that that was the worst heartbreak you would ever go through in Taurus. And then you get into the adulthood and you're like, I'd rather go back to that first one because I just, this is not it. <laughs> this adult shit's not it. It's still the same shit. We're just all adults now and everybody still wants to be playful. They still want to play the nonchalant game. They still want to play like, I don't care about you. Whatever, the, whatever this person's portraying, they're losing. It's not... I'm not, I don't know how to say that. I just, they're losing it. They're losing it. That's not a sword to reverse. That's like going ape. It's like your mind, you got your emotions all over. You're thinking, this person's saying all kinds of stuff. If it's not love, then what the hell is it? Well, I'll tell you one thing it is, cross watcher or Taurus. I'll tell you one thing. It's the king of swords and upright. Come in direct or don't come at all. Whoever this Taurus is or cross watcher or person is, they don't want to play anymore. Their wall is up. You failed to give them the um, the appreciation that they deserved. And I don't think that it was nothing much. I think that you were just trying to be petty. And that petty actually smacked you in the back of the head like a boomerang. Like, you meant to throw it and, you know, put a dagger in somebody's heart. And hope that was going to keep them up at night. But that ricocheted right off of them. It didn't do nothing. Not like you thought it would. 
Okay, you may did some pain, but nah. And you knew this person was helpless because they cared about you. You knew it. You knew that Taurus had their hands tied behind their back. Could be dealing with the air sign. Do not leave Aquarius or Taurus or Capricorn. That's what I'm seeing here. You you thought that you had it made in the bag, and you knew that this person was going to do this. When you were stabbing in the back, you knew they weren't going to try to hit back. They were not going to try to, you know, defend themselves. You wrong, whoever you are. I'm not going to lie. That's messed up. Seeing that like that. But spirits saw everything, so good luck. <laughs> good luck. Spirit, stop worrying. Stop the worries for Taurus. Not a coins in the reverse. Things that were slowed down in your life are going to come to life. Period, point blank. This is slowest night in the deck. Shit, not today. Not today. Everything these people thought that was going to slow down for you. Or, you know, Taurus is going to be so heartbroken forever. No, they're not. <laughs> you played yourself. Like I said in y'all's last reading. People keep playing themselves around these Tauruses. You can't sleep on them. They're not, they're, you can't sleep on a Taurus. Okay? You can't sleep on any Zodiac sign, to be honest. When you have something good, when you have something good, learn to appreciate it while it's there. Okay? Learn to appreciate it while it's there. Quite like you got it in the bag and shit. Like, you know, no. Trying to save face and all that. Like, grow the, grow the hell up. For real. Does it not, does, it does not matter anymore, Spirit for Taurus. Three swords in the reverse. It doesn't matter anymore. You're healing. You put the wall up and that even like, no. I cried. I had sleepless nights. I was sitting there wondering, what the hell did I do so wrong to be treated like that, knowing that I wasn't going to do nothing to hurt anybody? And then this is what happened. It hurt for a minute, but nah, we're back up. We're getting there, Taurus, okay? If you're not there all the way, you're going to get there. You're going to get there. Do you understand what I'm saying? You're going to get there. It doesn't matter anymore. Like I said before, when I put the card out, I said, before this tarot card was here, I said, Taurus, it's already there. It's already done. There's nothing you can do to change it. And I think you're starting to figure that out yourself. A lot of air and earth energy. Can y'all believe that? No cups have shown up. No cups. No cups. Someone here lacks emotional stability, emotional maturity, and emotional communication. They don't know how. And it could be having to do with a lot of past trauma or they just, they're not, they're not for you. They're just, I don't know. I just, why won't you just cave in like you normally do? Like this person's like, because honey, you're going to get karma. That's why. Literally Taurus, Libra energy. The justice card came out. That's why I'm not caving in. You're going to get what it is that you deserve. Like I said at the very beginning of this reading. I cannot make this up, Taurus. Some of you might feel like it's the same message. No, it's not. No, it's not. Somebody is meant to hear this message at this specific moment. For real. Any message I put out, it's meant for somebody. Justice. Things are being made fair, honey. This is balanced. Do you see? She's got like... Mmm... I never saw this card like this. She's got like a, a, a bandana or something, a scarf over her eyes, but that scarf is see-through. Like I said, God sees everything. But stop the worries. I kept telling you that at the beginning of the reading. They saw everything. So whoever's sitting here with this energy is... Oh, why is this happening to me? You know exactly why this is happening to you. That's sweet. You got that little nice coffee offer and things. And you have this solid conversation that you want to have because you're feeling this person that you did not appreciate. But you know exactly what you did. You didn't have to do that. You didn't have to do this. No, you didn't. You chose to do it. You had every opportunity in the world. To make a different decision. And that's what you chose. Hmm. Not a pinnacles in the reverse. You ain't, you ain't stopping nothing. That's what you thought you were going to do. You ain't stopping nothing. Seven of wands in reverse. This person feels so vulnerable. 
I'm also feeling the energy towards that you're feeling vulnerable with yourself, putting these walls up. And that's a beautiful thing. Hear me out. That's beautiful when you're vulnerable with yourself. When you can be nice and good and kind to yourself. Instead of beating yourself up all the time, having those repetitive thoughts, I should have said this, I should have said that. You shouldn't have said nothing but what you've already done and said. It's already over. It does not matter anymore. We're going towards the healing. It's no, it's not going to change. And we have to accept a lot of the time that people come to us this way. People come in the shape and form who, of who they are. And to be so selfish and be like, oh, well, they're going to change for me. No. No. They're being given the gift. Now Spirit wants to see exactly what they're going to do with it. Having free will, that is. What are they going to do with it? It's not, a, it's not like you're a carrot being dangled in no one's face. No, Taurus. There's a gift being bought into this person's life. What are they going to do with it? This is what they chose. The hands are tied behind the back. Yes, like... And then this person looks like they don't have any garments on. No shirt. Mm, mm, mm. Naked with truth. Naked with their emotions. Naked with their vulnerability. Naked with their feelings. Naked with their heart chakra. Just naked. Do you know how vulnerable people feel with no clothes on in front of other people? They show their true loving self. And this is what you did? I'm still going to say it. You're wrong for that. And you deserve every bitch you get. Because you think there's no one out there watching. Okay? That sword by this person going down. You're not going to get the truth you seek. You're going to get the karma you seek. It's like a feather tickling your nose. The same feather that's on the side of this justice card. Do you see that? All those lies, all those games, they're coming back in whatever way the universe decides to give them back to you. Period. Spirit. This Libra energy. Six of Pentacles. Six of Pentacles. Things will be made fair, Taurus. Everything that you gave out, you're going to get that back. It's justified. You're going to get that back. Okay? Don't worry. You're going to get it back. And I ain't even laughing. Y'all know I'd be laughing my ass off. But do you see how this is so unbalanced? But that one hand is coming in with that pentacle. And as soon as that mother effer lays right there on this Right here, the scales is going to be big. They're they, they going to be balanced all right. Justice said so. Good luck with that. Whoever you are that's giving out free swords in the back towards the people that want to be vulnerable with you. And you do it on purpose because you feel that you can get away with it. You feel no one's watching. And you feel people don't, won't, won't ever stand up for themselves. I pity you. At the bottom of the deck, we got the Wheel of Fortune. In the upright, there's karma all over this reading. The Empress. How dare you backstab the Empress? I just got through saying, you are a gift. And this person fumbled it. They fumble bad. The Empress in the Upright. That's Libra and Taurus energy. This Justice card is Libra energy. This is freaking karma. I'm not even joking you, Taurus. Then at the bottom of the deck now, we have the Eight of Cups in the reverse. Eight of Cups in the reverse. They want to take all of that back. Somebody won't let you go. Even though you've already done you done it. You 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 like I said for some of you you have done it, but it's okay. It's okay. Alright, top of the deck here, page of swords. 
And all they can do is stand and watch and hope to have a chance to communicate with you. Taurus, the ball is definitely in your court. The ball is definitely in your court. I feel you, Taurus. Oh, I feel you. Yeah, you feel me all right. Did you feel what I went through when I was standing there with those swords on my back? Did you feel that? Oh, no, 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 you didn't, did you? Oh, yeah. You were the one. Oh, you were the one actually stabbing me. So, of course, you didn't feel it. Oh, okay. Life goes on, right? Perfectly. It's a fast circle. What you give out there, you're going to get that back. Welcome to the real world. Spirit, energy, so we can close this reading out. Thank you. Mm. Taurus, it's up to you if you want to talk to this person or not. Okay. Spirit's leaving it up to you, but they're going to have to face whatever they did to you. They will. And Spirit wants you to know it doesn't even matter anymore because you're going to heal. You're going to get through this. But this person did take you for granted. They are going through a bit of financial issue right now for some of you. Okay, some of you are financially helping this person. Not only financially, but energetically. They felt your energy. That's why there's emptiness and boredom. And it's chronic. It's heavy. And all they coming in with page energy, page, page, page. Page of Pentacles. And we got the Page of Swords. And then over here we have the Knight in the reverse. And we have the Knight of Pentacles here. Those are both in the reverse. So, whatever this crazy thinking this person had, okay, they were going to slow things down for you. The answer is no. They're not slowing anything down. The only person that can stop you is yourself. Energy, please, spirit. Death card in the reverse. Nothing's ending for you, Taurus. Comfort in the reverse. They're not comfortable. Then we have fear in the reverse. But you're not fearful towards what's ahead. Bottom of the deck. Wow, didn't I just say, Taurus? Pain is growth. Mm hmm. You reap what you sow, man. You fucking do. You really do. And uh, after all this, I would really like to just get the hidden truth, Taurus, for you. Can I do that? What this person may want to say. Okay. What they're hiding. All right. We know they're going through the chronic feels. Okay. We know. What else is new? What else is new, right? I left when I saw you with someone else. I left when I saw you with someone else. That might mean something to one of you, Taurus, okay? Someone may have saw you with an aunt, a mom, <laughs> a, a friend. I left when I saw you with someone else. Whatever. That could also be you, Taurus, a hidden truth. You saw something you didn't want to see. This person saw something they didn't want to see. And so they backed away. You could have backed away. However it goes. It may go for two of you. It may go for none of you at all. Let me just at least be fair and send the back of the deck. It's time for me to heal now. Exactly, Taurus. That's your truth. I feel many of you, that's your truth. It's time for you to embark on that journey. If you don't start now, then when are you going to start? Next week? Next week, right? Maybe a month? Start now. What's stopping you? You. That's who's stopping you. I hope that this gave you some clarity, Taurus, okay? I really do. Um, take care of yourselves, Taurus. Have a very fantastic, awesome Friday night. Some for you Saturday morning, okay? Um, take good care of yourself, value you, Taurus, respect you, be proud of you, okay? Be proud of yourself. This was a lot to go through. I don't know, I feel like it is. And I can't get over this, like, like, come on. You really had to, you really had to, uh, whatever. I guess, if that's what you feel, whatever. Okay, Taurus, I love you guys so much with all my heart. 
If someone says, just smell this and love you, they are lying. Okay, they're lying, they're lying. Take a care, Taurus, and do the healing. It's time. I love you. Bye, guys.